Hey guys, today we're gonna do some more programming on the Pokemon game. I think this one's gonna be kind of a time lapse of me programming some doors. Let's see if we can get some doors going. Because I really, really like doors. Hey guys, I am back. This door isn't behaving like I wanted it to. Great, so now whenever I press J, this button, this uh, door actually opens. That's great. There we go, we inverted it like this. Great. Uh, now what do we do? I guess we try uh, hooking up some of these to the cutscenes. That's a great idea, right? So, uh, just like we, uh, I can show you this, and it would be way better. When we exit a house, we get a tiny little cutscene that just changes the world. Uh, but that it, it has the foundation for cutscenes, right? You see this down here, change world event. Great. Uh, so let's make a cutscene event that will open the door because that is something we sorely need uh, if we want to have these nice doors. Alright guys, I am back. I made it so that when I press J we get two new events queued up in the uh, event queuer, I believe I call it. Cutscene event queuer. Okay, so we queue two events. We queue that the door is opening and then the door will be closing. So we should see a door opening and a door closing when I press this J button. Let's try. Great. And try a few more times and we'll just keep on opening and closing. I can't walk around uh, while this happens. I can reface though for some reason that's a bit strange.
Okay, guys, whenever I press K, we queue a piece of dialogue, a, a, a not a piece of dialogue, a piece of cutscene, a cutscene event that will make me walk north. Let's try. Oh, that's not correct at all. Why is that not working? Hmm. All right, into debugging mode. All right, I fixed it, guys. And it works nicely. So whenever I press K, we queue one walk north event. Great, now we're walking around, we see our door, we would try to enter it. Great, now the only thing really left here is for the character to uh, go invisible once he steps on the door. And I think I know a way we can do that. Great, so now there's a little tiny wait uh, when the guy appears in the door before he walks out. I feel like that should make it a lot better. Yeah, I think it did. All right, we are done. Let's try it one time without showing the cue. Wow, that's uh, that's really nice. I gotta say, that's pretty nice. That is it, guys. This is the end result when we walk into the house. Door open, we walk in, change the scenery, and we walk in. Great, let's walk out. 
awesome we get this little cute animation awesome if you like this format where I just skip the entire programming part please leave a comment about it if you like it even if you don't like it leave a comment I just want to know what you want to see uh, because it's really difficult without any feedback to know what's good and what's not good so uh